Hello everyone, Game Dog here, and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Reborn. So I want to say last time we started off the slums right here, um, let's see, excuse me, I'm studying Pokemon gang activity. Have you seen any suspicious behavior? Um, some of us are going to be seeing some pretty soon at some point in this game, but we're going to we got another tech right here. These guys, um, I don't think I've actually explained this archetype before, they usually have electric types. Um, this is not the greatest matchup actually. Do I think that's, uh, that, that, that goes neutral. This guy being a Steel-type right now is actually a little bit, oh my goodness, the one thing you'd go for. Uh, being a Steel-type right now is actually a little bit annoying. Well, at the very least, you're not gonna, really going to attack me after that. <clears throat> oh man, I can't emphasize how annoying uh, Paralysis is. I just went back to the Pokemon Center between episodes. Uh, let's see here. <laughs> you know, I, I, I can't help but think that uh, maybe on occasion, okay, well, obviously not here, but maybe on occasion of these fan games, there's always like that one guy who's just there solely to be annoying. Um, let's see here. Well, I am getting kind of lucky with this uh, paralysis here. Is this doesn't kill me? Okay, good. Uh, well, the very least, uh, hero lived that. Okay, well, uh, let's see here. I'm um, getting some experience and uh, Joltik. Okay, um, I'm starting against Joltik. I don't really want to stay in though. I say we go to um, to the Flutterby right here, and I think he, yeah, he has a flying move. So this thing is like part electric, part uh, part bug, which is a very neat combination. I like this Pokemon quite a bit. Especially its evolution, too. Uh, let's see, you're gonna use Screech. That lowers my, uh... Yeah, that has my defense. Um, this guy does all, is also an electric type, though, which I am weak against, so this is a little bit... Oh my goodness, so this guy's just gonna paralyze my whole team. That's annoying. Okay. Uh, hopefully we can electro What does that do? Oh, it's just an attack. I thought that was, um... Oh, is that, that's an interesting attack. I thought that was something else. Okay, well... Oh, don't kill, don't kill the Flutterby. Come on now. Oh my goodness, I'm so mad right now. Um, let's see. Do I have anything in my bag that can help me here? <clears throat> Let's see, I got a Repel, I got a Whip Dream, um, I got a Paralysis Heal. I might use that after this battle, actually. Um, let's see here. I mentioned before that, um, we might be getting to the point in which Flutterby, uh, might be reaching his peak usefulness. Yeah, you're just gonna use Electric Web. Okay, okay, what I think I'm gonna do after this, um, I'm not gonna go back into the Pokemon Center. I'm gonna go, um, let's go to Saxon, actually. You're so fast, but you're probably gonna be able to outspeed this thing. Let's see, uh, yeah, Quick Attack should have no problem, especially with that attack on my, my arsenal right there. There we go, okay, we took this full out. Oh, and a level up, too. Okay, that's really good, that's really good. So we're gonna take out a Techie Navi. Well, um, that afforded an up, an up, yeah, that that was an unpleasant diversion. Okay, oh man, especially since you're gonna paralyze my whole team apparently. Let's use this real quick. Um, let's use it on Hero because he's like the only live guy we can actually use it on. Uh, we do not have any means to heal health though. That's a little bit annoying. Uh, that is a Scraggy. What on earth? Huh. Okay, that may have actually been the reason behind those uh those like moving boxes or something. How do I? Oh, there's like a there's like a hidden area there. Okay, well, oh man, th this 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 level being a um here the box may not be an ordinary box in fact it probably isn't um what the heck okay i'm just hitting the oh okay i was i was just hitting the button over and over again uh let's see the box is just like apparently just doing crazy things right now uh the crazy box is all over the place here maybe there's a cat in there or something hello Oh, um, did a box just get, yeah, just give birth to Pokemon? Um, what? Okay. <laughs> yeah, I really think that's just a Pokemon in a box. Anyway, let's see. We got another Street Rat right here. Uh, these guys usually aren't too big of an issue. Cascoon doesn't really do much. I do have three health, though. Any attack will kill me at this point, I'd imagine. This does, like, one damage, which I do, which I could expect to happen here. Okay, you're just gonna use Harden. This might let you, li let this, let you live this next hit, though. Um, I'm hoping it doesn't. Okay, good. Didn't let you live. So he's going to be down. He should get a level up off of this. Yeah, there we go. He's level 17 right now. And a Paris. Um, Paris takes quadruple damage from flying. So this may actually be a one-shot. Um, let's see. Yes, it was. Okay, good. Yeah, being part bug and part grass. Oh, man. Uh, Paris is kind of a neat Pokemon. He is a trash typing, though. I, I, like that. That's probably my the worst thing about him, honestly. Like, I just really wish he had a better typing that just synergized a bit better. Um, oh, we have a shuriken right there. Okay. Yeah, I, I really don't know if I'm going to keep calling them that this whole playthrough. I, th I think that'd be kind of funny if I were to, though. Um, let's see here. Uh, can I get past here? That appears to be a locked gate. Um, I'm hitting X on it, or the Z key um, is uh, what I have as my uh, confirmed key right now. It does not appear to be doing anything, so I say we go down here. Um, let's see, we got another shuriken right here. Let's talk to this guy right here. Our, yeah, our creator just ran by. It's mine, I tell you, mine. So he really wants that scraggy or whatever was in that box. Okay, well, yeah. We have uh, another street rat right here. You have a Silcoon. Are you just like a polar opposite of the other guy? Because Silcoon and Cascoon have very... Oh, we actually have more health now. Um, are very common Pokemon. Like, they both evolve from the exact same Pokemon. And he's using the exact same moves as well. Oh, wow. Now watch this one live this attack. 
Nope, okay, well, I'm, I'm actually kind of glad for that, because Hero is dancing on very low health right now. Okay, so you have a C dot as well. Uh, C dot is... C dot's a grass type, right? Yeah, I, I, don't, I don't really use C dot, but, um... I kind of want to... Let's go to, um... Yo, let, let, let's stick with Hero right now. I can level up Hansa later. I can always do it off screen if I need to. Um, although I do... don't. I don't want to over-level my Pokemon, which is something that happens in this game a lot, I hear. Okay, you're going to use Growth. Uh, you're just going to raise your attack, and I think that raises your special attack, too. Yes, okay. And then, uh, let's see. Bide. You're probably not going to live long enough for, uh, for that uh, to actually uh, be used in effect. Okay, good. So we'll take this guy out. And, uh, okay. I say after this, actually... Um, let's see. Fine, it's yours. I say after this, we go back to our menu, and, uh, we put Hans back up front so I can start to, um, get some levels on him. That and I want to say something we're coming up on. Yeah, there's another scrag right there. That and I want to say something where someone, uh, something we're coming up on is actually weak to, um, to fairy. Um, I'm not percent sure. Well, I, I, I know, I know it's weak to fairy, but, like, I'm not sure if it's coming up next. That's kind of what I'm saying. Um, I'm gonna run for you, actually. I don't really want a Trubbish right now. Okay, good. Yeah, I always want to use a Trubbish in a playthrough. Alright, alright, so we've healed up our Pokémon, um, and we have, uh, Hello. They were in the boxes! Okay. Okay, now I gotta say, this is something else I really like about this. Um, if you see here, it's called a Pokémon game. This is a, um... This is what this actually is. Uh oh, I, oh, I didn't know we were going to send out Lord Dreadmore. I would have switched out if I knew this was a double battle. But what this actually is, and I really like this, it's a Pokemon who is treated as a trainer. Um, which is really clever, and the game does this quite a, quite a, thing, quite a bit, I think, for the game. Now, okay, Scraggy evolves into a dark and fighting type. Um, is, he a, is, he, is he a dark fighting type now? If he is not... Okay, no, he is, he is still a... Yeah, he is still a... Uh, uh, a dark type. Okay, I, I kind of thought he wasn't for whatever reason. Oh well, well, okay, Lord Dreadmore is probably not going to be as uh, effective in this battle as he normally would be. At the very least, we have Hans, and uh, actually, because these guys are part dark, um, they actually take quadruple damage from uh, from that from that particular attack. Let's see. Um, I'm going to do these even though, yeah, he already he already is the fastest, so probably not a probably not the best idea. But we managed to kill him anyway. Got a nice and powerful speed boost, and uh, oh wow, that just one shot you all together. Okay, so if they're level 14, I can actually kill him in one hit. That's good. And Han's leveling up, too. Ooh, Cotton Spore. What does that do, actually? I forgot what this does, which, pro which means it's probably not really that great. Isn't that raises that defense or something? Um, let's see. Partially reduces the speed stat of an opponent. I don't think that's too great. Yeah, okay. Yeah, we won't learn that. Uh, we don't really need that with, um... A Cotton Spore? No, get rid of that. Yeah, don't learn Cotton Spore. Okay. <clears throat> let's see. Um, how many... How much Pokemon does this guy have? Um, let's see. Uh, I want to say the Scraggy right here. Oh, man, this guy is Intimidate, too. That's also, um kind of a difficult factor because um yeah it's also kind of a difficult wait what wait 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 fairy wind oh that's interesting i can hit right here and it, it, it like it like hits an invisible wait is that pokemon invisible what on earth oh wow well i never said this was this was the best oh man uh like like with a lot okay no game is about flaws here can i hear my own opponent yes i can actually uh let's see here <laughs> Yeah, no games about flaws, and uh, like a lot of RPG Maker games, there are there are silly things that happen sometimes. Uh, I, I do really like RPG Maker. It is one of my favorite um, things for actually making get what on earth, but uh, <laughs> but on occasion, silly things like that can happen. I I, I think it's actually something to do with the um, with the Pokemon uh, engine that's actually used to make these games. But oh my goodness, I've never actually seen that in a game uh, before. That is very funny, actually. Um, I don't care if Lord Dreadmore dies here. I'm probably gonna... Yeah, I'm probably... I don't really want to use... I didn't want to use him in this battle anyway. He might gain too much experience. Um, that's gonna do more damage than usual. Oh, wait a second. He's not a... Uh, he's not a... Wait, are you a Psychic type yet? Oh, no, you're not. Oh, that, that's when he levels up. Okay, that's... Well, I'm just being dumb right now. Let's, let's send out Flutterby because um, because we can, honestly. Lowest level Pokemon, I might as well. Uh, Fair Right Wind is gonna kill this guy, no problem, because he takes quadruple damage from it. Uh, let's see, you're gonna get a level up and, uh, okay, just swagger on Hans. Okay, Hans is like half attack right now, so that's probably not gonna be too big of an issue, um, if I do by chance hurt myself. Let's see, I'm gonna have, uh, you use, a uh, Gust on him. Yeah, because uh, he's actually weak this. Not, not quadruple damage, but he does take significant damage from it. That's actually a solid to a kill, actually. If you can get through his confusion, yes, you did, and, uh, oh, wait a second, no, Fairy Wind is a special move, so it actually wouldn't have been affected by Intimidate anyway. Okay, good. So we got some level up, and, uh, we defeated the Pokemon game. Uh, the, the poke. Well, okay, we haven't defeated the game quite yet. We defeated the gang. Okay, so um, what happens if I talk to you? No, he's just gonna move this thing away. Hmm, interesting. Okay, let's let's follow him. Let's follow him. Let's see how how far this goes. Um, can I get through here somehow? 
I want to say this leads back to the area where... Oh, wait, no, this is, a, this is the other side of the ward, actually. You know what? I want to say there's still some more things we can do in here. So I'm going to head back in real quick. Um, Let's see. I want to say you can also go back here at some point and get a Scraggy yourself. Or maybe it's an enemy you run into at some point. No, we still have more Mankeys here. I really don't like Mankey that much. Let's see. I, I think I'm just going to kill this guy for the experience. Uh, Karai Chop will not do much damage whatsoever, being that I resist that. Oh, uh, my goodness. Fairy is such an interesting niche right here. Like, I really like the Fairy type, and this is why. Like, he, he just has a lot of really convenient matchups against a lot of Pokemon. Uh, can we only get one this early is very good as well. I really like I really like, um, I like Hans. I really like um, Slurpuff, and I'm kind of glad I was able to use him. Yeah, there was something, uh, I think there was something else up here that I was able to search. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna... I could just be thinking of something else, actually. If not, I'll probably just uh, head back. But I want to say there was, like, a, another way I could go up here. Um... Was it this? Wait a second, does this lead to a locked area? Yes, yeah, was the locked area. Okay, never mind, then we'll go back down. And then I see we head out to that ward. There might be a Pokemon Center there, so we should be able to, to heal poor Dreadmore. I probably don't want to use him that much, though, because, uh, let's see. I, I don't really want to use Lord Dreadmore that much, though, because he's the highest level right now. Hans is very close to, to evolving right now. Um, oh my goodness. <laughs> this is why people use repels, but trust me, it doesn't really take that long to run away from Pokemon. Uh, I think I've explained how Repelza uh, works before. Very poorly, mind you, but I did uh, nevertheless. And uh, most people like to use them in playthroughs. Honestly, it takes like two seconds to run for a Pokemon, so I never really see the point. Uh, let's see. Okay, so what do we got out here? Um, okay, this appears to be uh, civilians in the area are advised to take refuge in the core reward. Please direct yourself south until the situation is resolved. We're probably not going to be doing that. Civilians in this area are advised. Oh, you say the exact same thing. Okay, what about you? Um, let's see. How am I going to go shopping if they won't let us in the, into the Obsidian Ward? That is the least of our problems right now, alright? Okay. The Obsidian Ward is the largest ward in all of Reborn. Funny then, uh, th that the Core Ward just south of here on the lake is the smallest. Huh, okay, so they're trying to, like, force people into that, uh, just to get them safe. Uh, this gate leads to the Bi- yeah, the Big Bison Wasteland. Such a rank place. Debris from across the region appears there without explanation. They're right to keep it locked up. Oh, this area here is very creepy right here. We'll, we'll get back to that later. Um, oh, okay, we do have to get funneled over here. What, what do these guys have to say? The Coral Road, uh, though small, used to be a great, uh, bustling pier. Ever since the lake became toxic, the pier shut down. Now it's more like a ghost town. Huh, these are sailors, too. I don't think they appear that often in this game as well. What's going on in Asibia? Uh, you don't really want to know. It, it's, it's creepy. Okay, let's go back this way oh there is a uh, pokemon center here okay good um oh wow look at the fog effects in this world um that is a pokemon wait that, that that's a that's a the text is too old and fade to read is this a gym huh interesting do you have anything to say about it strange building that one it used to be a beautiful gym uh back from the first incarnation of the reborn city long ago the gym leaders lived in harmony but every yeah but everything changed when the when the the uh the meteors attacked. Um, only, only this gym leader, master of the mysterious type, could stop them. But when Reborn needed them mostly, he vanished. Ever since then, the gym has been neglected. And, and, and look at it now, huh? It's all, it's all run down now. Okay, what's in here? Um, oh, Skitty! I really like Skitty. I see the Skitty. It fell, yeah, it fell from a long ways up. It was really badly hurt, but I can fix it. I know I can. There's a little, little kitty right here. Skitty. It's a kitty. I like Skitty. All right. Um. Oh dear. My grandson is stuck on the on, on the idea of healing Skitty himself. If uh, we only took it to a center, it would be just fine. But he's so stubborn, dude. It's like right over, right over. If uh, we could give him an ultra potion or something, that might yeah, that might be enough. Oh dear. Huh. Maybe if we get one, we can come back here at some point and get the Skitty. See, we already have um a good solid team, and I, I want to say Radicate is better than Skitty um in a lot of ways. Uh, let's see here. So I want to say, okay, hope to see you again. Me too. Okay, um, you're just sleeping. You know, I, we, we got, we got, um, we got through the new area. So I think I'll see you guys next time. Let's play Pokemon Reborn. Thanks for watching.